guys, today we're going to be showing you how to do this. I call this Super Warrior Brothers. Oh, uh, wait. Let's play this. I'll just show you, like, the first level. So, there's a bunch of things changed, like the graphics, the colors. So, I will be showing you how to... And the level stage design. So, I will be showing you how to change all this. So, I've made Wario, Super Wario Brothers, so it's challenging. Uh, like this. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. So, also, you know, oh yeah, free stuff. Well, bad means boy. What? <clears throat> Anyways, I'll be showing you how to do this. So, so we'll first start out with, this is episode one. I'll be doing one of these more okay so i'll be showing you in the first episode i'll be showing you how to uh, edit the level so first thing is gonna you're gonna need is isd smd utility this is a, a level editor hack where you can go in so i have two smile bros wario bros so yeah there's a lot of stuff you could do it's kind of confusing. Um, you can only use the stuff that's already been placed down. You can't put down your own stuff, but you can. So you have to like you can change it for stuff with certain stuff. Yeah, so that's a warp pipe and stuff. You can also change the warp zone. Yeah, I'm sorry. Yeah, it's pretty confusing. The names are pretty confusing, but. You'll just have to get used to it. So, yeah. And then, uh, how do you edit the enemies? You just click. You can change whatever you want. Change it. I'm going to change this to about a hammer brother. It kind of seems like to do that. Uh, there's still a lot of bugs. So... That's basically how you do that. So then, so you how you change the text and stuff. So if you want to change, um, the, um, what's the tag? Oh, there you go. Okay, where is it? Okay, so if you want to change the text, you click here and you can change it whatever you want. So if Luigi, well, we'll call it change it to Waluigi because it's my name. <laughs> and then, um, Nike Okay, you can't change that. So another castle, and then the Nike and Wario Jumping. So this is how you do it. What if I, so, to make this simpler, and then write, and then we'll write it changing. I don't consider messing around with these. I'll show you how to change them later without having to mess around with those. Okay, so, that's, and then you click, so if you want to, like, so, if, how about, like, if your mouse thing is in there, if you want to start where the, your mouse is, then you will start with this, okay, so, let me show you how to change the title screen. You need a thing called STE Super S Super SMB Title Title Editor. It is in like a different language, so I'll tell you how to work this. So, so literally, you can just get one of these, place it down, just place a new thing down. So I made it say Super Warrior Brothers. But sometimes you have to make your own custom, um, custom textures for, like, um, that thing. I had to change the texture for it because, um, there's nothing like that. I, so how you save is you first press this and that. 
So pretend if I like had too much stuff on the screen. Then if I had like a lot of stuff on the screen, it will do that, and you can't like. So you have to. So you can't put too much stuff on the screen. So so you just press this, this, and then this thing that says Romeo. This is how I remember it. So I just remember this one says lol and this one says Romeo. You click this, yes, and then okay. Now we'll save it. Okay. Let's see. Uh, I think we have a little bit more time to do one more thing. Or maybe I can show you all of it. Okay. What else? So the next thing you have to do, get download is Tile Layer Pro. You can literally use this on any NES video game, but this is just for. I'm using this just for Mario. So this is where you edit the textures. Don't mess with any of that stuff. If you really wanted to, you could break the game if you really wanted to. Okay, so this is all the textures. So as you can see, I changed the textures to look cool. The Zumba changed the textures. Changed a bunch of textures. And so literally, so if you want to see the whole thing, because these aren't like all connected, they're like eight by eight squares. You just put it on there. Then you edit it like this. Yeah, so. yeah. You have to sometimes search. Sometimes it's hard for me to find things, but. That's basically how you change the textures. Go into here, mess around with all the stuff. Um, yeah. Next, last, a uh, next, and certainly last, you need this specific emulator. So you need an emulator called F C U E X. F C U E X NES emulator. So. You have to have this specific NES emulator because it lets you change the color. So let me show you how to do that. So let's go. So you're also going to need one of these pictures which has like NES colors with numbers. These are all the NES colors and these are all the numbers. So first thing, go to tools. Wait, I don't even remember how to do this. Since you don't know any. Let me just um, figure out how to do this and I'll show you. Okay, so I just figured out how to do this. You press debug and open PP Viewer. This is all the colors that's on the screen right now. And then, you go to debug again and then text editor. You do file, wait no, ed, no, view and then ROM file. This shows you all the colors. So pretend I want, so these are the colors that Mar uh, Mario has. Or Mario, I mean, you can call them anything. So, 043628. So, let's find that file. Let's see. So, we go find 043636 and 28. Let's find that. So, it's right here. 043628. So, pretend you want him to be Waluigi. You would change your colors to, so 04 is yellow, right? Okay. No, 04 is purple. So, all the chips, black overall. So, it could be any of these black, so I'll just make it two, E, wait, no, okay. <laughs> two E, and then that. So, I'll just leave 36 as it is, 36. So I'll just leave that. So 28. 28 is yellow. So I want that to be purple. So oh four, I think. Yeah, oh four. Oh four. Then let's let's play the game as see Waluigi. So then so you make it how you make it per minute, you press file and then save ROM. 
or if you want to make a new ROM, just say press same ROM as. But I want I'm not saving this because so yeah, you just press save ROM when you're done. And that's basically how you edit your Super Mario Brothers games. And um, if you want to see more videos like this or tutorials, I'll um, let me know in the comment section below. Subscribe and like, and I'll see you guys next video. Goodbye.